بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم می ڈیئر بردرس اینڈ سسٹرس ان اسلام السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ایم ڈاکٹر حافظ سعید احمد ماڈریٹر آف اسلامک اسٹڈیز کورس ایم ان فرنٹ آف یو فرسٹ آف آل آئی وڈ لائک ٹو سی بگ تھینکس ٹو ایوری ون آف یو دیٹ یو ہیو سبمٹیڈ یور ریسپانسز سکسیزفلی بٹ آئی ریکویسٹڈ یو بائی دا اینڈ آف دا لاسٹ سیشن دیر آر فور کوشچنس ایف اینی ون آف یو اسٹل ان ایبل ٹو سبمٹ یور ریسپانس پلیز لسن دیٹ لاسٹ سیشن اینڈ سبمٹ می دا ریسپانسز ٹو دا کوشچنس وچ آئی آسک بائی دا اینڈ آف لاسٹ سیشن تھینک یو ویری مچ دس کورس آفرس دا بیسٹ اینڈ دا فائنسٹ پاتھ وے آف دا سکسیز دا کانسیپٹ آف سکسیز دیٹ اسلام اینڈ قرآن پرزینٹ اسلام یونیکنیس از دیٹ اٹ پرزینٹ دا ماڈل آف سکسیز دیٹ میک یو سیٹسفائی ہیئر اینڈ ہیئر آفٹر دس از دا بگیسٹ کوالٹی آف اسلامک کانسیپٹ آف سکسیز دیٹ از وائی اسلام اینڈ قرآن نیمس دا کانسیپٹ آف سکسیز ایز ٹو ورڈس فوز اینڈ فلا وچ انکلوڈس ایوری ٹائپ آف سیٹسفیکشن دیٹ ہیومن نیڈس وچ انٹیگریٹس a personality or human being in every aspect of life for example every personality or every human being has four major components body mind heart and soul so in that way every human being has four major needs four physical and intellectual and spiritual and emotional islam is only the deen only islamic path presents you to have success and satisfaction in all these four areas of human life spiritual satisfaction physical satisfaction and intellectual needs and emotional needs this is the quality of islam let us see where and how the quran includes every type of needs as a success of human being for example in chapter 103 the shortest surah of the holy quran surah al-asr it talks about the meaning of success the concept of success in islam There are only three verses in this surah. A'uzu billahi minash shaytanir rajeem. Bismillahir rahmanir rahim. Wal asri inna al insana lafi khusr. Illa al lazina amanu wa amilu salihati wa tawasaw bil haqqi wa tawasaw bil sabr. So see this shortest surah of the Holy Quran. How beautifully this surah explains the meaning of success. Quran says wal asr by the time. innal insana lafi khusr verily the every single human being is in loss lafi khusr khusr the word is from khasara in arabic khasara means loss the true loss innal insana lafi khusr every single human being the doctor the engineer the journalist the political commentator or politician or even the king anyone anyone who belongs to any sphere of life or working any walk of life everyone is in loss this is the quran says innal insan quran is using the word insan insan alif lam in the beginning of the word insan it includes every single human being believers non believers from any part of the world lives he she is in loss this is the quranic word the question is then who is not in loss who is successful quran says surah al-asr says illa allazina amanu except those people illa allazina amanu those who have faith wa amilu salihat those who do righteously good deeds wa tawassaw bil haqq wa tawassaw bis sabr 
those who not only do righteously good deeds by themselves but they recommend each other to do righteous what was so be sabr and recommend each other to stay patient so look the last aya of this sura illa allazina amanu wa amilus salihat wa tawasaw bil haqq wa tawasaw bis sabr this aya talks about three major components or three important contents faith spirituality and character allah rabbul izzat says illa allazina amanu those who are unsuccessful everyone but successful are illa allazina amanu the first course content faith those who have faith but faith only having faith is not you know enough having faith having faith that allah is only the one prophets sent by the allah subhanahu wa taala for the guidance of the human being faith in that this life is going to end some day and there is another life after this life only to have faith is not enough all the books we have faith that all the true is not enough but it needs the next phase next phase is wa amilu salihat doing good deeds what are the recommended acts to be do and what are the unlawful things to avoid wa amilu salihat doing the right practices number 3 what was so bil haqq what was so bil sabr recommending one another to do right yes and recommending one another to stay patient the later part of this verse is talks about the character character of human being faith spirituality and character and there are so much characteristics which furnish a personality but allah subhanahu wa taala chose here only the patience what was so bil haqq what was so bil sabr because of the significance of the patience this is one of the finest ability or the characteristic or the feature of a personality which makes a man or woman the best and utmost personality in the eyes of allah subhanahu wa taala is the patience if you have faith if you are doing righteous deeds but if you are impatient that's mean you have faith but your character need to be improved so that is why our course contents are three which are very much linked and related to this sura sura 103 available in the later part of the holy quran to 30 sura number is 103 it consists of only three ayas the third aya of this sura talks about our course contents faith spirituality and character in next session inshallah aziz we shall study about three important questions in the beginning of this course why religion why islam and is islam religion of peace thank you very much for your time and we shall share with you the question as well on your screen before the next session we would request you to please submit your responses to these questions thank you very much wa ma alaina illa al balagh al mubin